We've talked quite a bit about healing the body, but in this section, I want to focus on the mind. The mind and body are closely connected. Whatever impacts one also affects the other. Reversing diabetes isn't just about protecting your heart, your eyes, or your kidneys. It's also about taking care of your brain, your thoughts, and your feelings. If you want to improve your health, you need to be kind to your mind. An ancient Chinese philosopher once wrote, watch your thoughts, they become words. Watch your words, they become actions. Watch your actions, they become habits. Watch your habits, they become character. Watch your character, it becomes your destiny. Our thoughts and beliefs are powerful. They influence the way we act and the habits we form. That's why it's so important to think good thoughts. Dealing with a health challenge like prediabetes or diabetes can seem overwhelming. You may have felt discouraged in the past when, despite your best efforts, your health didn't seem to improve. I'd like to share some thoughts with you that will give you hope. First of all, I just want to remind you that you're valuable. You're the only you in the entire universe. Your life matters. I'm not sure what your faith background is, but I believe that each one of us was created in the image of a loving God and designed to experience an abundant life. But whether you believe in God or not, I'm sure you'll agree that human life is precious, including yours. Think about the most valuable things you own. You treat them carefully, don't you? The more valuable something is, the more time and energy you want to invest in it. Since you're valuable, your health matters. It makes sense to invest time and energy to take care of yourself. Does it ever seem like an overwhelming challenge to take care of your health? There are so many things to change that you don't even know where to start. I'd like to encourage you with the fact that you may be a lot closer to health than you think. Health isn't just a destination, it's a journey. Every step counts. The important thing is that you're moving in the right direction. You can be healthier today than you were yesterday. You can be healthier tomorrow than you were today. Yes, health provides fantastic long-term benefits, but it also pays off right away. When you make healthy choices, you benefit from them immediately. The third encouraging thought I want to leave you with is the fact that healthy choices are doable and sometimes much easier than we think. Many of my clients have had brain blocks to exercising or to eating healthy because they thought they had to do it all at once and do it perfectly. Thankfully, that's not the case. Any health plan that works has to be practical and doable enough to actually fit into your life. If you hate running or going to the gym, then that shouldn't be part of your health plan. Instead, Maybe you want to find a walking buddy. You have to make it work for you. It's the same with nutrition. If you don't like cauliflower or Brussels sprouts, I don't want you to have to eat them. Any nutrition plan that works will include foods that you enjoy and know how to make or buy. Don't get discouraged about change by making it seem harder than it actually is. You can have confidence that health is actually within your reach. I hope these thoughts are encouraging. As you move forward in your health journey, it's important to think positively. It's probably very natural for negative thoughts to start filling your mind, like, I can't do this. I've messed up too many times. It's too difficult. Or, I'm just a failure. When these thoughts come up, challenge them and replace them with true thoughts, like, I will keep moving forward. I'm valuable, 
and so is my health. I fell down, but I'm getting back up. I want to reach my health goals. The ancient King Solomon once wrote, as a man thinks in his heart, so is he. What a powerful concept. Our thoughts become our realities. As we think like healthy people, we'll continue becoming healthy people. Some people need extra support to stay encouraged and take care of their mental health. And that's perfectly okay. Many people benefit from counseling, especially from cognitive behavioral therapy, or CBT. This technique will teach you to replace damaging thoughts with healthy thoughts. I encourage any of my clients who are interested to take advantage of CBT counseling. Many studies have shown that people with diabetes have increased rates of depression. And people with depression have increased rates of diabetes. If you're feeling hopeless about your health, I encourage you to be kind to your mind. Talk to a counselor, to your doctor, or to a trusted friend. You don't have to do this alone. The good news is that not only will taking care of your mind benefit your body, but taking care of your body will also benefit your mind. Healthy habits like nutrition, exercise, and sleep provide powerful benefits for emotional health. That gives me hope because at the end of the day, I don't just want your blood sugars to be better. I want you to feel like a million bucks.